disgraced former FBI director James Comey squared off with Trey Gowdy's congressional Republicans for a second time. Comey left the closed-door meeting spitting fire at Gowdy and President Donald Trump, but he crossed the line and he instantly regretted this attack on Gowdy and Trump. Gowdy and Comey sparred on social media after Comey's initial interview with members of Congress. The South Carolina Republican was appalled that Comey laughed off the interview by constantly claiming he couldn't remember key details about the FBI using the fake news Christopher Steele dossier as the central evidence to win a FISA warrant to spy on the Trump campaign. Comey returned for a second interview and round two was just as explosive as the initial encounter. The former FBI director emerged from his second appearance before Gowdy and other Republicans and held an unhinged press briefing. Comey ranted and raved that Gowdy and other Republicans were trashing American values by not standing up to President Trump. The president matter, the rule of law matters, and the truth matters. Where are those Republicans today? At some point, someone has to stand up and in the face of fear of Fox News, fear of their base, fear of mean tweets, stand up for the values of this country and not slink away into retirement, but stand up and speak the truth. Comey's cheap shot about slinking away into retirement was a direct attack on Trey Gowdy, who earlier this year announced this would be his final term of Congress. The former FBI director also accused President Trump of burning down the FBI's reputation in repose to the shady circumstances surrounding the bureau agents interviewing then-National Security Advisor Michael Flynn on January 24, 2017. Because I knew that if anything came of the interview, if it advanced our investigation, the attack from the Trump administration would be that an Obama holdover had engineered it. And so I had to make the decision separate from her to leave them with their only opportunity to challenge it would be to burn down the entire FBI. To my shock and horror, they've tried to do just that in the face of silence from people in this building. This unhinged rant ended up being a massive mistake. Press Secretary Sarah Huckabee Sanders handled the response. Sanders tweeted out that Comey was a fraud who abused his power and that Republicans like Gowdy did the nation a tremendous service by standing up to Comey's lies and corruption. If you're sick and tired of fake news from the so-called mainstream media and want real news that you can trust, please hit the subscribe button on our YouTube channel.